nearly $700 million of the $873 million trust assets allowed to be sold by FTX comes from Grayscale's flagship product, the Grayscale Bitcoin Trust or GBTC, and bankrupt crypto exchange FTX has been given the green light to sell around $873 million of trust assets with proceeds used to rebate creditors impacted by the exchange's collapse in 2022, according to a November 29 filing in a Delaware bankruptcy court. And the $873 million in assets will be sourced from FTX's stakes and various trusts issued by crypto asset manager Grayscale Investments, valued at $807 million and custody service provider Bitwise, valued at $66 million. And while the court document references a total of $744 million um, in assets, this is due to the valuation figure being as of October 25th, 2023. Uh, the assets uh, have uh, increased in value uh, since, and the approval comes nearly four weeks after FTX debtors filed a motion to Judge John Dorsey on November 3rd, requesting the sale of the six cryptocurrency trusts, including the Grayscale Bitcoin Trust, Grayscale Ethereum Trust, and Bitwise 10 Crypto Index Fund. FTX currently owns over 22 million units of GBTC, Grayscale's flagship Bitcoin product, now worth $691 million, while its 6.3 million shares of ETE are now worth around 106 million million. Uh, Grayscale's Ethereum Classic Trusts, uh, Litecoin Trust, and Digital Large Cap Trust are the three other trusts that FTX can now sell to recoup funds for impacted FTX customers. Uh, FTX's administrators headed by John. Uh, J. Ray 3 has been working to recover assets since Sam Bankman Fried's former empire collapsed in November 2022. Uh, so far, around $7 billion in assets has been recovered, with nearly half of that coming in the form of cryptocurrencies, $3.4 billion uh, in June. FTX's debtors estimated the total amount of customer assets misappropriated was $8.7 billion. Meanwhile, Bankman Freed was convicted on seven fraud-related charges on November 2nd and is set to be sentenced on March 28th. And he remains in Brooklyn's Metropolitan Detention Center for the time being, where he recently paid four mackerels in exchange for a haircut.